it's, it's difficult to keep people focused for long periods doing repetitive, unstimulating jobs. But the robot obviously will do this, give the same result day in, day out. After scrutinising the material that's been sorted by the, the smart system, it's quite evident that the accuracy is reliable and certainly I believe the, the outcome is much more reliable than it would have been done by people. At Lyra we create the brain, the eyes and the hands for the next generation of robotic systems. Today we're here in Bundaberg and our robot behind me is sorting pineapple tops. That task is done manually and involves a lot of hours standing in front of a bucket of pineapple tops, picking them up, looking at the size of them and according to that sort them into three different bins. This is a task that's very mundane, repetitive and very dangerous as well because there's lots of spikes into the pineapple tops that poke into the fingers of the workers. Certainly uh, labour is, is a big issue with our growing operation here where we've got a core group of, of people and hiring extra labour to do tasks, particularly boring manual tasks like sorting pineapple top. Even long-term employees uh, roll their eyes when we suggest that their job for the day would be sorting pineapple plant. It's been demonstrated quite clearly that the action of uh, sorting plants into different size categories is, is quite reliable with the technology that, that we've been exposed to today.